Welcome to this channel. In this particular tutorial, we will design and simulate a transistor C configuration circuit. We will try to measure the various node voltage and currents across the transistor C configuration. We will also try to simulate the transient analysis and the DC analysis for this particular circuit. For more such videos, I request you to like, share and subscribe to my channel below. Click on use schematic and in this select the component and from this list we have to select NPN and click OK. Place this particular NPN transistor on the schematic window. Now right click on this and click on pick a new transistor and select 2N 222 which is a NXP based uh, transistor now click OK and uh, now click on resistor in order to rotate this resistor use Ctrl plus R and place a second resistor R2 on the schematic window as shown in this particular tutorial next we require a voltage source so click on components and select the voltage place this particular voltage source so one particular voltage source will be VDD and uh, click on wire extend this particular wire and click on ground place the ground across the negative terminal of the voltage now right click and define the value as DC value as 5 volt click on label net and define this as VDD place across the wire now click on wire and connect the transistor to the resistor R2 and extend this wire across the resistor R2 define the label net as VDD across the resistor R2 click escape now click on wire connect the base of transistor to resistor R1 and click on component and place a second voltage source which would be the input voltage source for our circuit now place the ground connection across the voltage source V1 and connect the resistor R1 to the voltage source right click on the voltage source define this as V in and next we have to place a ground across the transistor Q1 now once the ground is placed connect the transistor to the ground and now define the resistor right click on the resistor and define the value of resistor R1 as 1k and resistor R2 as 150 ohm right click on the voltage source and define it as a sine wave define the DC offset as 0 amplitude as 1 and frequency as 1 kilohertz next we have to define the various analysis so click on edit and click on spice derivative or we can click on spice analysis and select the DC operating point and click OK and place this dot OP which is the operating point so which would help us to determine the node voltage and the current so save this particular uh, design on your uh, system by uh, giving a name called as transistor CE and save this now run this particular simulation and you would see all the operating point which would define the node voltage and the current value next let us say we have to perform the transient analysis for this particular circuit so again go to edit and select the spice analysis and define transient analysis define 
the stop time as 4 millisecond and place this on the schematic window. Now run this particular simulation, place the probe across the input and across the output. You can see the transient analysis for this particular circuit. Now let us say we have to perform the DC analysis for this particular circuit. So click on spice analysis and select the DC sweep and the name of the first source will be V in and uh, the uh, type of sweep will be linear. Start value has to be zero and stop value has to be one volt and click OK and place this on the schematic window as shown in this particular tutorial. Now click on wire and extend the wire across the output of the transistor and place V out on this particular wire. Now save this and run this particular simulation. Place the probe across V in and place the probe across the V out and you can see the DC analysis or the DC sweep for this particular circuit. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope this has helped your learning purpose. I request you to like, share and subscribe my channel below.